All right, guys. So I thought I'd give y'all an update on my shingles because I was diagnosed with it last Friday. And as you can see, the swelling is all is all gone. These spots here, they're still there, but I mean, that's really not that big of a deal. Let me pull my glasses off so y'all can really get a look at my eyes. As you can see, no, no changes. So that's really good. Just very relieved that, that I got through it. I think I got to it just in time, just before it ended up started to get a lot worse. As you can see, I am outside. I've been doing some work out in the yard. I just got done uh, shredding. And as you can see, there's my pile. This was probably about maybe, oh man, five or six bags of stuff. So yeah. So I'm just now starting to get ready to uh, record the first line cutting video. I'm just working on just slowly putting some stuff away. You see, I just got the chipper shredder put away. And I got my tripod and the GoPro. Got them all ready. And we're going to be doing the mowing with this lawnmower. But unfortunately, the electric start doesn't work. And I think I know why. I think <clears throat> I think my adapter uh, doesn't work anymore for it to charge the battery. I think that was probably why that the, uh, the battery was dead throughout the winter. I literally thought that I did charge it. I think what makes me think on why this thing doesn't work because usually when this thing is plugged in for for a while I mean this whole box it's usually warm and just with it being plugged in I let it stay plugged in overnight and that thing wasn't even warm at all so I'm actually plugged in the uh, battery adapter for the Lomboy 10606 to charge its battery and let's see if this one is warm. Mm. How about if I just unplug it? And yeah, I can barely feel it that this one is warm, meaning that it is working. And that it did have a red light on it. The light was green when, just before I had plugged it into the uh, lawn mower. So I know that one does work. So I'll just need to see if I can get another one of these. Maybe if I can find one online or maybe see if I can find one at my local Sears, which luckily, luckily I still have a Sears right near me. But if not, then I'll just I won't worry about it. All right, guys. So, hope y'all enjoyed this little live stream. I'm just about to get ready to uh, do the lawn cutting video. So, I I probably won't have the lawn cutting video uploaded probably till sometime tonight. And so, uh, stay tuned for it. And uh, I'll see y'all later tonight.